the mess in this attic Lot going on, but there ain't no need to panic Come on up and join, we getting wild, getting manic Spitting truth for all you fanatics, uh Every week got something new to say Ain't no filter, this shit coming straight from the brain It's coming straight from the brain Yeah, it's coming straight, coming straight from the brain What's up, everybody? Today is Tuesday, May 24th, 2022. There's a faint sound of bagpipes in the background, so God rest whoever's soul for whom they play these bagpipes. Unless, of course, it's a joyous bagpipe session, which is possible. But, you know, in, the, in American culture, it seems like bagpipes equals funeral. So, sad to hear. But I'm coming at you today with a positive experience. Yes. Are people dying today? Yes. Are there bagpipes being played for these decedents? It seems like it. Today is not a funeral. This episode is all about good times and creative expression. It's going to be a quick one. It's all about Garrett Ritterhouse. Garrett is a fellow from Dale Carnegie here in Grand Rapids. Uh, very good. Tra- he's into training people and helping people express themselves and helping people meet their potential through, through leadership and executive development. And after we met a few times, he came up to me at an event and said, You may not know this, but uh, I really like to rap. Okay, and that was a surprise. Maybe I had judged a book by its cover. Either way, I was surprised to hear that Gary Ritterhouse was an inspiring MC. And so he had never recorded himself. He asked if he could come by. Uh, the day that he asked me, I put together a quick track for him. It took about an hour. Here's a sample of that track without any vocals. I sent that to Garrett. Garrett took his pen wrote out a few verses, and within an hour was at the attic. And within two hours from that, we had a produced track. You're about to hear the produced track. You're about to see the video of Garrett performing this track. Why am I sharing this? Well, there's a lot of reasons. Number one, because you're gonna be hearing more from Garrett. He's going to be coming on the show more uh, because I think he's very talented. Uh, And so this is kind of an introduction to that. Number two, I want this to be a lesson for all of us, myself included, and that is if if there's something you've been wanting to try and do, there's something that you've been practicing, but you haven't really put the pieces together to to actualize it and to produce and make it, then let Garrett be a lesson. All it takes is a call. He got a hold of me, and within a few hours, we had his first ever real track. And that's inspiring to see because you are sitting on a talent, I bet, or, or something that you want to become talented at. And you just maybe haven't pushed yourself enough, or maybe you're nervous to do it, or maybe you uh, just, whatever, whatever's missing, find it, okay? And if that thing you're missing is me, aka somebody that could help make it happen, hit me up. Let's do this thing. It doesn't mean we have to share it on the podcast. If this, if this session wouldn't have had gone as well as it did with Garrett, then I wouldn't be sharing this. But the reality is he murdered this thing. He knocked it out of the park, and so I'm going to share it. For you, maybe it's just something personal you want to try. Maybe you've been working on the guitar and you want to hear what it sounds like recorded so you can listen to that back. Hit me up. We rent studio space here. Um, if you're a friend of mine, we can just do it. I'm, I'm trying to practice a little bit anyway, so I need some people to want to come through here. So, folks, let Garrett be a lesson. If you want to try something, try it. Quit waiting around, okay? So those are the primary reasons why I'm doing this. And the third reason is, well, don't you like good music? Fuck. Come on. This is a good jam. I guarantee you it's an earworm. It's going to be stuck in your head. Okay, enough talk. Let's get into this episode. Let me play for you this short track by Garrett. We named it Not Even In Love, and it's about a 90-second freestyle. Let us know what you think. Share it. Tell your friends. Look out for Garrett Ritterhouse, produced by you, this guy right here, because we are going to make some uh, things happen here in the future. So this is kind of a first sample. Someday you'll be able to tell people, I saw Garrett Ritterhouse's first rap ever, you know, before he was taking home all the Emmys or whatever the, whatever it is he ends up doing with his career. But this is the start of it. Take it away, Garrett. This is the coolest shit of my life. Shouts to Kirk, boy. In the attic. Never knew that you could be my weakness. But now I'm done. I'm just left here sitting speechless. And you keep having fun. When do I decide? I don't need this, you weren't my one But I'm still cursed and I'm still hurt That you keep moving on Well fuck that shit, I'm not over it You said we'd have home and kids Emotionless and open pit Hear me out, you owe me this You owe me this You taught me what broken is 
pick up the pieces I told you I don't really need this An atheist praying to Jesus Damn, do I need to pray to a God? What's all this about? Hoping he's there and he can figure me out Hoping every day, keeping the emotions at bay I don't even know what to say I'm so done, why did you do this to me? I'm so broken, laying open here on the street I'm drunk and I'm not even in love